Welcome back everybody to Video Games Awesome Live. This is Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney Justice for All. What? <laughs> How many cards does he have? Oh. Up his sleeve. As many as he needs. He's a, it's He's magic, magician. Becky. He's been doing it for three minutes. You can't oh, yeah. figure it out yet? No, I figured I'm it out. Like, I know exactly how he's doing it. How's he doing it? Magic. Oh, fuck. Magic. You're right. Alright, uh, so he's got a bunch of psych locks that we gotta break down, find out what he's been hiding. I'm going to present to him... He's a witch! Mega Tomahawk! <laughs> slam, slam, slam. <laughs> Meeting with Russell. Last night, you met with Ringmaster, the Ringmaster, correct? To negotiate your salary and such? Exactly. We reached an agreement about the salary from my six-month-old contract. That's the truth? The whole truth? What do you mean? You just went to his office to negotiate your new salary? I hate lies and I hate lies even more. What are you insinuating? Do you have any proof that I did something other than negotiate my fee? Oh. The proof is the oh, contract that, that, that it was signed shows, a week ago. Yeah. Take that! D -d 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 that! I was on the table in the ringmaster's room. You weren't lying when you said that you've received quite a raise. The problem with being well compensated? Not with the compensation, just with the date. It's dated a week ago! <laughs> Max! You finished your contract negotiations a week ago. F -f -f fabulous oh. All right, I'll tell you the truth. That night, the ringmaster called me to his room. He called you? Why did he do that? Sorry, sweetie, that's private. The ringmaster called him. I wonder if there was some sort of problem. Uh, Max, perhaps you could share with me what you two spoke about? Well, not that I have to. Isn't this why you he called you the room? The bottle? The the upset that they did? Like Yeah, or maybe. That he had a run in with Ben? Yeah, maybe. Bam! Take that! Isn't this why you were called to the ringmaster's room that night? Where did you get that? The cafeteria. But you already knew that, didn't you? <laughs> of course! Yes. Yes. You would fell and broke on the floor. He's still hiding something else. Max? What is it, my sweetie? It didn't fall and break on the floor. You used this bottle too? Show Ben? Yeah. yeah. Take that! Take that! Ben? Whoa. Wow. Oh, you can see uh, the dummy. Yeah. You nailed him over the head with this bottle, didn't you? Oh, I want to see that picture again. Uh. And that's why you got called to the ringmaster's room th that night. F -f fabulous You might as well be a magician. Flawless victory. <laughs> the dummy totally looked angry. Yeah. <laughs> he had his arms in the air and everything. <laughs> Alright, tell us about that meeting. The truth is, yesterday... Morning, during breakfast, we had a run-in. You mean you had a fight with Ben the Ventriloquist? You could put it that way. Why did you fight him? Ben seems like such a quiet man. We fought about my sweetie pie. You mean Regina? That little brute creep stole my sweetie pie, princess, that he was in love with her. Would you put up with that? Ilbred? Are you talking about the same Ben? Told her he was in love with her. Are you sure this is Ben we're talking about? Twice her age. All I can say is that he made me mad and I had to tap him on his hard head. I really want to see this puppet. <laughs> <laughs> That's when the ringmaster called me and I realized it was my chance. Your chance? That when I went to his room, and I laid it on the table, I asked him to let me marry his sweetie pie! What? The ringmaster told me it sounds good to me! I bet you he didn't. Mm-hmm. 
That's why my sweet pie is my sweet pie. And no one else's. Hmm, let's see. Since Ben was causing me so much trouble, I realized I had to shut him up. Shut him up? Shut him up. Oh. Um, what do you mean by shut him up? I... What do you think, Ben? He's still his dummy. Oh! You don't know, do you, my sweeties? Unless Ben and Trilo are together, huh? Trilo can say a word. Trilo? The puppet. The friend Trilo Chris puppet. His real name is Trilo Christ. <laughs> nice. <laughs> but a puppet doesn't talk! I know, that's why I hit it. Before the police came and took me away, of course. If the puppet started flapping off the blaster, Flapping off at the blast eye, I'd be screwed. <laughs> you hit him? You mean the ventriquist puppy? You are so smart, sweetie. Um, where did you hide him? Yeah, Ben Triloquist. Ben Triloquist. Wow, that's cool. Yeah. What, sweetie? You aren't thinking of trying to add him to my defense, are you? Well, Ben does seem awfully lonely without his puppet. Fabulous! That should have taught him a lesson! Okay, I hit Trilo in the ringmaster's room. You don't mind going there to get Trilo for me, would you, sweets? No problem! Not at all, thank you, Max! No, I can't have to see my sweeties in jam. Then don't go hiding puppets. Or chasing waterfalls. Hmm. Alright, let's go back to the ringmaster's room, see if we can help out Ben, get him talking. Oh, oh. Huh? Ben's not here anymore. Yeah, I wanted to ask him something. He's called out. He probably went in the tent. Let's see what's in the tent. This is the longest first day of investigations ever. I think they said that. That yeah. it's like quite long. These, Usually you just jump these days. into, like, you have a little bit of investigation on the first day, then you have a, the trial right away, and then your second day is, like, the meat. I kind of like it, because it feels like we're actually getting some content. Yeah, but I also like to, like, get it all laid out and see what the, the, the persecution's strategy is and stuff. Yeah. What do you think, Nick? I wonder if we are making any progress. Don't be so negative. Of course we're making progress. But everyone loves the ringmaster. And there's no sign of footprints at the scene. There's still a lot of mysteries left to be solved. Of course. And now Richani isn't here. I'm not seeing how that's related. <laughs> oh, she said... <laughs> she's thinking that things are bad because Regina is not around. Aww. <laughs> she's totally she's infatuated. so in love. <laughs> Oops. Oh. Huh. That was an accident. Oh, hey, Ben! <laughs> Hello, you too. It's awfully cold today, don't you agree? <laughs> don't you think it's cold, Nick? <laughs> I don't see how talking about the weather is helping our case. All right, we'll come back to him. We know he's in the cafeteria now. We need to get his puppet first. Okay. Where is it going to be hidden? I don't know. Wasn't it in here? In the room, master. Supposed to be. It looks the same as always. A great big mess. Considering how messy it is, I bet they wouldn't notice if another poster were in missing. Not Will you just stop with your poster pilfer? Yeah. I'm just kidding. You know I already got one of these posters. You mean you stole one of those posters? Yeah. Uh, let's focus on Max told us. He said that he hit Trilo somewhere in this room. I'm spitting all over today. I don't think that anyone can see it. <laughs> I think they probably could. Especially <laughs> if they rewind. All right. Trilo. Oh. Oh, the ventral was... Zip. Where do you think? In that crummy desk. This desk? This is strange. Everything else looks nice. Okay. Nope. Uh, in that desk. Wait. This is where the ringmaster... Okay. You think in the front one? Yeah. It's more of a table. No, no, no. Oh. There is mud caked on the table. 
Someone with a terrible manners must have put their shoes on the table. Max totally did. Nick, don't even think about it. I wasn't. How uncool do you think I am anyway? Huh? Where's the dummy? Hmm. Underneath the floorboards. There's nothing that appears though. Nick, look at all the cute trophies. Okay. Hmm, there's something shoved under the bookshelf. Hmm. This is... That's Trilo! That's been his puppet! I think you're right. We'll give it back to him later. Trilo quiz, hand it over to Maya. Why do you have to carry this thing? Do I have to carry this thing? Alright, let's go to Ben then. Straight away. Nice. Check it out first. Yeah. Ventriloquist puppet, an operatic tenor who doubles as Ben's sidekick. <laughs> ah! Ben! This is yours, isn't it? Yes, that's mine! Here you go! Ventriloquist, return to Ben. Alright, Maya, let's get going. It's that time, isn't it? See you around, Ben! Double OK. So, Nick, where are we going next? Let's see. Maybe we should go talk to the clown once again. <laughs> this is you, Ben. <clears throat> hey, can you kind of dimmy, dimmy? Hey, wait. <laughs> but say it louder, though. That, that hey, part. wait. <laughs> Who said that? What are you looking at? <laughs> I'm right here, you blind wench. <laughs> What's your problem, anyways? Don't you know I'll probably greet someone? <laughs> <laughs> Ben, is that you, Ben? No, 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 no. No, no, no that's me. Oh, oh, crap. No, 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 no. It was me. Yeah, <laughs> me down here. <laughs> you, you're Trilo? It's Mr. Quist to you, sir. Learn some manners before you just blurt out my name. Now, try speaking <laughs> to me again, but this time with some proper respect. Put your shit up when you do that voice. Go like, which is proper respect. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Not again. Sigh. Mr. Quist, is that better? No! Look at me when I'm talking to you, you 8 bit excuse for an attorney! But this game's in 16 bit! Trilo, we talked about insulting people. <laughs> You're promised. Oh, he's punching him! <laughs> But he was mocking me! <laughs> Being mean to bullies was not included in the deal! <laughs> I'm sorry, Trilo. <laughs> Nick, what just happened? Trilo is still a puppet, right? I've written to Nick with puppet! Hey! What do you think you are calling me a puppet? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Alright. I guess we can finally get some info out of these guys. Nice. So when we come back, we're going to grill Trilo Ben Triloquist after this.